quickly to Pierce. Pierce fakes it. Kicks it. Ray for the game. Got it. Five tenths of a second to go. Well, there was the play. Pierce drew the defense. They had three-point shooters in, and somebody set a pick for Ray to get deep in the corner. I don't know who it was. Probably Big Baby. But it worked to perfection. Well, it's still a half a second here. That's right. Still time for an alley-oop. Uh, over it goes to Pierce. Now you watch Big Baby set the pick. Beautifully done, and Pierce baited them with the penetration. Uh, get your three-point shooter. <laughs> Don't hug him too Ray. much there, Big Baby. There it is, over the top, and there was uh, Ray's defender being picked off by Baby. 12 points in the game for Ray Allen in this fourth quarter. Five of seven from the field in the fourth quarter, 23 overall. Miller throws it up, tipped away, Bogan. Celtics extend the winning streak on the Ray Allen three and beat the Sixers here tonight, 100 to 99. Outstanding effort by this team playing without Kevin Garnett here tonight. The Celtics keep the winning streak alive and it heads into the Laker game on Thursday night in Boston. Patrick O'Brien doing his job, made a difficult pass. That was Glenn Davis, and right now, Greg's with Ray. Go ahead, Greg. I'm with the hero, Ray. Take me through that final play, and was anything changed from the full timeout to the 22nd timeout? <laughs> uh, it almost did. When they called 20, we came back, and we drew up, uh, Doc drew up another play, and it just didn't seem as flexible as the first play, so we said, let's stick with the first play, so it worked out for us. I know you had a touch of the flu, a uh, tough time at shoot-around this morning, tough night last night. How did you battle through it? Just try to stay off my feet and get as much rest as I could, but you, you never know. Once you come to the game, anytime that you have any type of sickness, it seems like you focus a little bit more. 15-point lead early on in this ball game. What got Philadelphia back into this ball game and eventually a lead? Reggie Evans. Reggie Evans. Uh, he came to the game. He, he added a lot of energy. He was causing us to turn the ball over. He was getting putbacks, and uh, we really at that time didn't have an answer for him. So. Um, we turned them, end up turning the ball over and, and, and allowed them to get back to the game. And, you know, we made the adjustment in the second half. You and I talked about this a little bit before the game tonight. Tell me what it would mean for you to get selected as a replacement for Jameer Nelson and go back to the All-Star game again. Well, I always say it's an honor to be, be a, uh, an All-Star in this league, no matter how many years you've done it. Uh, it's always a, a great, great testament to how hard each individual player has worked. So it's unfortunate that he went down uh, last year. I was added as a replacement. So, you know, if my name was called, if they picked me to come as a replacement, I'd love to be there. Uh, family would love to be there. You know, I'm sure another player in representation of the Celtics, having three of us there is, is, is just enjoyable for the fans as much as it is for the three of us and uh, the gathering team. Take this the right way. I hope you have the flu on Thursday as well. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks, Ray. Appreciate it. There's Ray Allen. The game winner, the three, which is .5 seconds to go. All, all this despite battling the flu bug. Mike, let's go back to you. Two three-point field goals for Ray Allen in the final 30.